Hello students, uh, you know today we are going to um, uh, do your favorite topic I should say. I always say that your favorite topic is that's rights. You all know what are rights everywhere we feel at this age that this is also my right here also this is my right. So it's always your favorite right and you most of the time claim or blame your parents, your teachers in the name of कि हमारे rights आप लोग disturb कर रहे हैं, right? So let's understand about this chapter. Very very important, easy, and it will obviously help us in living a better life. Rights. In introduction, I have made these short points from your book only. So let's introduce. We all, adult, children, women, men need rights. You know, everyone needs rights, and uh, if Everyone is getting rights. Obviously, we feel better in our, in our life. We all talk about rights. Uh, especially adults always talk about rights. We all demand rights. Most of the time, I think once in a day, most of the students talk about their rights. Because you are very close to this concept. So, it's very, very important in our daily life. So let's understand what are rights now. Not everything one desires or feel necessary is a right. You don't want to wear uniform in the school, right? But still you are wearing because everything you want can't be right. Because it may disturb our law and order situation. If you want that I want to harm anyone because of your fight and all. You can't be allowed. Aapko allow nahi kiya ja sakta because it can it can also not be your right because it will disturb the rights of the other person. Due and necessary claims for leading a life of respect and dignity. <clears throat> In the name of rights, we really forget that others are also having rights. They also have their self-respect. They also have dignity. This is the reason that due claims are accepted to enjoy rights. Understood? Due and necessary claims are required to enjoy rights. See, if uniform will not be there in the school, what will happen? Everyone will wear as per their economic status. And it will really let uh, those feel bad who are not able to purchase expensive clothes. Okay, so that school which is teaching uh, so many virtues will be a failure if it will not be allowed. So try to understand uh, with healthy mind. And we need rights. Now the question is why do we need rights? We need rights so that we may pursue our talents, our interests and skills. Means you are free in your personal domain to choose. You chose arts. You are doing it because you you felt you are interested in this. You want to know more. So you accepted and you are studying. Right? So it's very, very, rights are very, very important so that we may improve at that level where we want, where we are good to get different opportunities. Obviously, it is also your right. You want to be engineer, you want to be doctor, you want to be teacher. So, opportunities. Here you should be given right and you are being given. For free expression of belief and opinion. Obviously, for self-satisfaction, it's very much required that we should have a say. Hum jo kehna chaate hai, wo hum keh sake. Whether that is being done or not, it's not the matter. The matter is, you are free to say. Like in democratic countries, we are free to even criticize government, which is not there in undemocratic rule, right? But we feel whether there is corruption in democracy also, but we are happy, we are satisfied because we have got the right to express ourselves, right? <clears throat> now, rights are universal in nature, means which right will be given to you, that will also be given to me. That's why anything which is harmful or dangerous for anyone's health or well-being can't be right. 
means you can't be given right to murder anyone understood because if it will be given to you because of its universal nature it will be given to others too so there will not be society there will be just jungle raj i should say and we will be wild animals okay so due and necessary claims actually help us to enjoy all the rights and anything which is dangerous for you which is dangerous for me which is dangerous for others can't be considered right means government can't permit k you can take drug or everyone has to take drug like we have right to equality right uh, universal adult franchise likewise in constitution it can't be written k everyone has to take drug no because it's not it's harmful and obviously to have universal in nature it's really uh, disastrous for a society hum constitution banate hain society ko ek law and order situation dene ke liye na ki usko disturb karne ke liye so i hope you understood the real meaning of rights it's not a word which to be used in every situation especially at your age okay thank you please subscribe my channel if you feel i'm going to help you thank you